All right, you start marching it right, right, right. Angle your body. Here's four, three. Tap it up right here for four. And then we're gonna be doing a double knee march behind after two. Double knee march behind. And tap it up two. Double knee march behind. Tap it up two. Double knee march behind. Tap it up for two. One more time. Double knee march behind. Tap it up for two. And listen up for you. Rock repeater. Travel the rock repeater. So I want you to have your heaviest weights. So normally I have like fives and sevens. I've got sevens, eights, and tens. We're going to be doing little breaks. We'll do like a combination of steps. And then we'll do a break and do heavy, slow weights. Okay? Listen up. Last one. Now, just face the other way and pass it up. Two more. We'll do that double knee march behind here. March behind. Tap it up for two. Double knee march behind. Tap it up two. Double knee march behind. Tap it up for two. Double knee march behind. Tap it up for two. Listen up. Knee repeater. Travel the knee repeater. Now, if you want to, make it a knee cha cha strap. Knee cha cha cha. Travel the repeater knee or cha cha strap. Keep that going. Last one now. On the other end, hand break hand. Hold this move. Now, you don't want to keep it right here instead of kind of going off the back. You want to be going off the side. Our next move will be an across the top and then a knee off the back. One more hand break hand. Across the top, knee off the back, travel and knee. Now, if you don't want to do the across the top, you can do it on the floor and still do the knee off the back. So just listen up. Other hand, hand break hand. Hand break hand. Hold this move. So when I touch, you want to do it on the floor. Can be your choice. One more hand break hand. Hand break across the top. Knee off the back and then travel and knee. You got it. Keep that going. Rock repeater. Travel the rock repeater. Now, make it a front side back repeat. Front, side, and back. Use your arms. Front, side, back. Front, side, and back. Front. I just want to warm up the arms. We will be doing some weights. We don't normally. That's why we don't normally do arms. Just a few more. Last one. Now, on the other hand, give me a mambo. Walk. Do that again. You can either march, march, you can hop to, or you can do a jack. It's up to you. Last one. Power reach L. And then travel that power reach L. 
Good job. Release it. Now find your balance on the right leg and give you that quadricep on the left. Abs are tight. Chest is up. Good job. Now release it. Bend your knees. Hinge forward. Trail your back and tuck your chin. Retract the shoulders. Now bring that left shoulder toward the right knee. And it's on your inner thigh and the back of the shoulder. Good job. And then release it. Same thing. Other side. And then release it. Center it up. Roll it up very slowly. On the floor. Watch it left. Angle your body. Travel glute. So when I tell you, on this end, we'll do that glute tap dance. Get ready. On the other end, glute tap down. Hold it here. So here again, when I tell you, we're going to freeze that glute. Working on balance. Freeze this next one right here. Freeze it right here. Good job. Find your balance. And then release it. Face forward. Right heel hangs off. Arm comes across. Now, release the arm. Step off with the right. Hamstring on the left. Interlace your arms behind your back. Squeeze your shoulder blades and lift. Good job. Release it. Release your arms. Step off. And march it right. Woo! All right, so I'll teach you one combination. We'll do it a couple times. We'll take a break and do some weights. So just angle your body to the right. Right foot mambo for four. Three. Get me a crosswalk. Remember your options. Crosswalk. Last one. Power reach L. And then travel the power reach L. Now on the other end, ham, great ham, and hold this loop. Now remember, the next move is going to be in across the top. So you need to be out to the side. Across the top, knee on to the back, travel and knee. On the other end, mambo for four. A little work on that crosswalk over here. There's two. Crosswalk. Keep that crosswalk. Off this end, power reach out, and then travel it. Last one. On the other end, hand, great hand, and hold this mid. We're right out on the end. One more. Across the top. Knee off the back, travel and knee. Alrighty guys, that's the pieces. I'm gonna cut it down. We'll go through it a couple times on each side, and we'll take away, take a little break and do some weights. Listen up. On the other end, cross walk one time. Power reach out. Other end, ham break ham. Other hand, cross walk. Power reach out. Other hand, ham, great ham. Across the top. Knee off the back. Other hand, cross walk. Just watch your bench. Power reach out. Other hand, ham, great ham. So you go across, keep it on that bench. Across the top. Other hand, cross, walk. Power reach L. Other hand, hand, great ham. Across the top. Now, the back, one more time each hand. Other hand, cross, 
clock. Power reach L. Other end, hand break hand. Across the top. Stay off the back. Last time, other end. Cross walk. I'm going to march it out. Power reach L. Other end, hand break hand. Across the top. Stay off the back. And march it right. Alrighty. We're going to be doing slow, heavy biceps. So, make sure to keep your head above your heart. Squat and get the weight you want. Now, if you need to keep moving, just give me a little heel. You can do a march. Give me a 90 degree angle. We're going to go up six counts, down for two, four, three. Here we go. Up. One, two, three, four, five, six, down two, and then up. One, two, three, four, five, six, down two, and up. One, two, three, and then down, and up. Three, four, five, six, down for two. Keep it going if you want to create a balance challenge. Five, six, and down. One, two, three, four, five. Now we're going to reverse it. Up for two, down for six. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Up for two. Up. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Up, two. And then down. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And up for two. Down. One, two, three, four, five, six. Up for two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Up for two. Up. Last time, five, six, seven, eight. Good job. Squat and release that weight. And then come on back and march it right. We're going to go back and learn another combination on your bench. All righty. Travel it in our thigh. Keep this going. Listen up. And out, down and jack. And travel it. Remember, you don't have to jack. You can calf pump. And out, and a jack. Last one. On the other end. Rocking horse around the world. Straddle. Other hand. Straddle. And traveling in our thigh. All right, so. Whew. I'm just having a rocking horse into a straddle. Rocking horse and exit. So she's half over what we just did. Other hand. Rocking horse into a straddle. I put in the warm up. Rocking horse and exit. Face the other way in mambo for four. So we're going to do it again right here. Here's two. Rocking horse into a straddle. Rocking horse and exit. Travel in our thigh. All right. So, once you do the rocking horses and you're on the front of the bench, we're going to inner thigh straddle, inner thigh get out of it. So listen up. On the other end, inner thigh straddle, inner thigh. Face the other way, Amanda. For two. Inner thigh straddle, inner thigh. Face the other way, normal repeater knee. Travel it. All righty. On the other end, inner thigh straddle, inner thigh. Face the other way to Mambo for two. Inner thigh straddle, inner thigh. 
face the other way in Mambo. All right, we're gonna do the rocking horse this time. Here's two. Rocking horse into a straddle. Rocking horse and exit. Face the other way in Mambo. Now this is where that inner thigh's gonna go. Here's two. Inner thigh, straddle, inner thigh. Face the other way in Mambo. Listen up, I'm gonna cut this down. In, out, down, and jack. Other end. Rocking horse into a straddle. Rocking horse and exit. Now face the other way, inner thigh, straddle, inner thigh. Face the opposite way, in, out, down, and jack. Now other end. Rocking horse into a straddle. Rocking horse and exit. Face the other way, inner thigh, straddle, inner thigh. Face the other way, in, out, down, and jack. Other end, rocking horse into a straddle. Rocking horse and exit. Face the other way, inner thigh, straddle, inner thigh. Other end, in, out, down, and jack. Other end, rocking horse into a straddle. Rocking horse and exit. Face the other way, inner thigh, straddle, inner thigh. Other end, in, out, down, and jack. Other end, rocking horse into a straddle. Rocking horse and exit. Face the other way, inner thigh, inner straddle, inner thigh, last time. Other end, in, out, down, and jack. Other end, rocking horse into a straddle. Rocking horse and exit. Face the other way, inner thigh, straddle, inner thigh. On the floor, march right. Woo! Step touch and hold it here. All right, dead lifts are next. Remember, slow and heavy. We're gonna be going down four, up four. So think about that as you choose your weight. March your right, squat, and get your weight that you would like to use. Woo. Now remember, a little wider than shoulder width apart. Retract your shoulders. Palm space your body. You're coming to a flat back. Now, if you have, go ahead and march for me. If you have back trouble, just go to your knees. And you can just stay there for four counts and then come up for four counts if you like. Get ready, guys. Retract the shoulders, head up. And here we go. Four, three, now come up. Four, three, going down. Abs are tight, shoulders are retracted. Once you got it going, try to keep that head neutral. Chin parallel to the floor. Weight is in your heels. Flat back. down, and up, just a few more, down, and up, Stay going, down, and up, last time, going down, and then I'll have you squat, release your weight, and we'll go back to the step. Good job. Release it. Squat. Release your weight. And it's time to learn a new combination. So, march it right. Tap it up right here. Big inhale. And a big exhale. Two more. Party walk. Double knee march behind. After this one, double knee march behind. Tap it up or two. Double knee march behind. Tap it up or two. 
knee, you're doing it one more time. Double knee, mark behind. Tap it up for two, now listen up. Squats across, apart, together. Do that again. Keep it going. Sit into those squats. Last one, then listen up. Rock repeater. And then travel that rock repeater. Woo! Last one. Now face the other way. Tap it up for four. Three. Party walk. And I keep the party walk. Woo! So, we're going to work on that double knee arch behind, facing this way. Two more party walks. Alrighty, listen up. Double knee march behind. Tap it up for two. March behind. Pass it up for two. One more time. Double knee march behind. Tap it up for two, then listen up. Squats across. Keep the squats. Get this going.
All righty. So your palms, here if you need to, keep moving. Palms are right here facing your ears. We're gonna be going up six and down two. And then we'll reverse it. Retract your shoulders. Tummy is tight. Here we go. Going up. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then down for two. Keep that going. One, two, three, four, five, six, down for two. Keep going. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then down for two. One, two, five, six. At any time, if you want to create a balance challenge, go for it. Five, six, down two, and up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now reverse it. Up for two. One, two, come down. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Up. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Up. Three, four, five, six. Two more times. Up two. Up. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Last time. Up two. Up. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Arms come down. Squat. Keep your head above your heart. Squat. Release that weight. And then march it right. Woo. And keep your march. Woo. Here's four. Three. Tap it up right here for four. And we're just going to be doing a Charleston right here. And two. Charleston. Step. Six. Tap. Back. Four more. And then we'll do a front side back repeater.
side back. Other hand, repeat our knee, our cha cha straddle. Straddle left hand. Three. Charleston. Front side back. Last time. Other hand, repeat our knee, our cha cha straddle. Travel a hand. Three. Two. Other end, Charleston. Front side back. Mambo cha cha, mambo hold. Mambo cha cha, mambo hold. Now just mambo hold. Stay here. Big inhale. Big exhale. Mambo cha cha, mambo hold. Keep the mambo hold right here. Woo! March it right on the floor. All right. French press is next. Remember, slow and heavy. We're going to be going down four, up four, and we'll go down four, hold two, up two. Knowing that, think about the weight you're going to choose. Squat to get the weight you would like. Woo. And remember, if you need to, keep marching. Give me some heels, something. Now your arms are right at your ears. Your elbows point right in front of you. Here we go, down four, up four. Four, three, start up, four. Go down, four. Come up, four. Going down. Coming up. One more time, this tempo. Going down. Coming up, now listen up. Down for four, four, three. Hold for two, up for two. Down for four, four, three. Hold it here, and up for two. Down for four, four, three, and hold. Up for two, take it down, last time. Four, three, hold it here, up for two. Woo, bring it down, good job. Squat, release your weight, it stays above the heart. And then march for me. Yes, I grabbed a sip of water. You need corn crab ones. Woo! Alrighty, guys. Last one <laughs> that we're going to learn. And then we'll do... We're going to take a little break. We'll put it all together. And then we'll end on the floor with a chest and with abs. Woo! So angle your body. Tap it up right here. Alrighty, so this is one we do a lot. Eight pounds around your bench. You don't want to go all the way around, you just march in place. Here's two. Give me eight counts. Eight, seven, six, five. Quiet stomp. One more quiet stomp and we do it again. Eight counts around, we march in place. Quiet stomp. Eight counts around or march in place. Quiet stomp. Listen up, you move. Jab that L. Travel the jab L. Woo! Now this one only has three moves. So listen up. Face the other way. Quiet stomp. Quiet stomp. We're going to do those eight counts going this way. One more time. Eight counts around or march in place. Quiet stomp. One more stomp. Eight counts around or march in place. Now, if you want to, 
You can do trample. Quiet stomp. One more stomp. Eight counts around the march in place or triples. Quiet stomp. Jab that arrow. Travel it. Listen up, starting on the other hand. Travel it quick. world. Listen up. Other hand, kicks around the world. It ends where you started. Face the other way. Quiet. Stop. One more stop. One again. Kicks around the world. Listen up. I'm going to add on. Other hand, jab L. Travel the jab out. Listen up. Face the other way. March in place or eight counts around. Quiet stop. One more. Now just travel a single kick. And we'll do the kicks around the world facing that way. Other hand kicks around the world. The other way and stop. Another stop. Kicks around the world. I'm going to add on. Woo! Jab L. Travel the jab L. All righty, that's all the pieces. The stomp is not part of it. Kicks around the world. Jab L. Eight counts around. Listen up. Other hand. Quiet stomp. Here we go. Putting it together right here. Kicks around the world. Other hand. Jab out. Face the other way. Eight counts around. March in place. Kicks around the world. in place or eight counts around. Kicks around the world. Woo! Other hand. Jab L. Face the other way. It counts around. Kicks around the world. Other hand. Jab L. Face the other way. Counts around and march in place. One more time each hand. Kicks around the world. Woo! Other hand. Jab L. Face the other way. It counts around and march in place. Kicks around the world. Other hand. Jab L. Face the other way. Counts around and march in place. Quiet stop. And again. Woo. Two more. Last one. On the floor, step touch up for four. And back. Woo. I just want to bring your hurry down a tad. I'm going to let you grab water. And we're going to go through all the different step routines. Just the step routine. Back. Up. And back. And march it right. I think the music's going to stop. Yeah. So I'm going to get started over anyway. So, grab a sip of water. Woo! Keep moving because you know we're going back to doing all the step. So you gotta keep moving, gotta keep the heart rate up. Woo! Alrighty. Let me fix my paper. 
so that I only call the step step. All righty. March it right. Big inhale, so the first one starts with that crosswalk. Big inhale, big exhale. Get ready. Four, three, crosswalk. Power reach out. On the other hand, hand break hand. Across the top. Now, the back, other hand, crosswalk. Now, just glute and tap down and 
Thank you. Big inhale. Big exhale. Four. Three. Freeze this next one. Working on balance. Good job. Release it. Let that heel hang off. Retract the shoulders. Step off left. On your bench, heels right left. Big inhale. Big exhale. Right heel up and freeze. And hamstring. Head above the heart. Good job, release it. Step off and march it left. Heels on the bench, left, right. Woo. Left heel up and freeze it. Good job, release it. Get that foot on the bench. Lean away into an inner thigh, hands away from the knees. Good job, and then come back to the front. Up on the back toe, rock the hips forward, retract the shoulders. Sit down in it, feel the hip flexors. Woo, and we'll stretch the arms after, because we're not done working them. Good job, release it, step off. Other foot on top. Lean away, inner thigh stretch. Good job, release it. Facing forward, up on the back toe. Rock the hips forward, retract the shoulders, and come on down in. Woo. Good job. Release it. Step off and march. All right, so two things left. Chest and abdominals. We are going to use our bench. So I'm going to lay on my bench. We're going to be doing chest flies. Woo. I'm going to go with my tens, and we're just going to do an up four, down four. So, squat, get your weights. You will not need weights for when we do the abs, but we will use the bench. Woo! So, come on down. You are the next contestant. Fine, let's do some chest flies. So, retract your shoulders. Start with your arms in the air. Get the shoulders retracted. Bend the elbows. Nice and slow, going to go down, four, up, four. Four, three, two, here we go. Four, three, two, now start up. Four, three, two, going down. Four, three, and start up. So if you're on your bench, it just allows you to go a little deeper than if you were just laying on the mat. Four, three, down. Up. Now, if you want a little extra work, you can bridge up, pressing through your heels, with some hamstrings and glutes and abdominals, going down, coming up, two more times, going down, four, and up, last time, down, four, Good job. Release everything. Now, for your abdominals, we're going to put all of our risers on one end. Your head will be at the top end. Whew. That one doesn't fit. I'm not using it. So, let's get you where you're like this. You've got a tall end and you got a shorter end. Whew. And they come lay with your head at the tall end. Whoop. All right, so come on down. We're going to start with just an upper body crunch. We're going to go up three pounds, down on one. So pat your shoulders, coming tight, and up for three. Three, two, one, and then down. Three, two, one, and down. Three, two, one, Three, two, keep it going. Three, two, three, two, last two, three, two, and 
two, one. Good job. And take a break. Now just cross your right leg over your left. Take your right hand out to the side for counterbalance. And we're just going to crunch our left shoulder toward our right knee. And notice I said shoulder. Here we go. Shoulder. Not elbow. Bring that shoulder toward the knee. Four. Three. Two. And take a break. All right, go do the opposite. Cross the other leg out. Other arm out to the side for counterbalance. We're going to be doing eight total. So don't just bend the elbow up. Bring the shoulder up. Get ready. Four. Three. Suck the tummy in. Here we go. For eight. Seven. Four, three, two, and we come to the floor. This is one we've done before. Someone drops a rope from the ceiling, and you're going to alternate arms and pull it down. So you can keep your head on the bench if you want. If you want to make it harder, lift your shoulders, legs off the bench. Pull that rope down. Pull, pull. Now the lower legs, we're going to do a bicep. The closer to the floor you do it, the harder it is. Closer to the ceiling, the easier it is. And if you need to, you can hang on right here. And bicep. And it's up to you if you want to point your toes or if you want to flex your heels. It's up to you what speed. I just want that low back to stay on the bench. Come down. Hopefully you felt that one. Alrighty, so we're gonna go back to a crunch. We're just gonna hold at the top three counts and then down on one. Retract your shoulders, suck your tummy in, up and hold. Here we go. Three, two, one, down. Again, three, two, and down. Try to get those shoulder blades off the mat. I'm just putting this hand here so you're not sitting there looking at my hand or my elbow. Three, two, just a few more. Three, two, again. Last two. Last one. Good job and release it. So you probably notice we're alternating between upper and lower. And that's on purpose so that I don't just completely kill you. So we're going to be doing leg drops. You start with your feet straight in the air and we alternate a leg down toward the floor. Here again, if you can tap, if you can tap the floor harder, and if you can't go down that far, just go to where it's comfortable for you. You can hang on on the top of your bench to help you. Retract your shoulders. And if you want to, flex those heels. Alternate drop, right left, down, and up. Here again, if you want to make it harder, lift the shoulder blades and don't hold on. Eight, seven, four, two, and one. Good job. Feet come down. So close. Oops. So, this is one time we are not going to go from upper to lower right and of course. We're going to do a reverse crunch. Now, this may not be comfortable on your back, so if you want to come to the mat, you can. We're just going to reverse crunch and then straight down. So, the point is to get your glutes up off the bench. Alrighty, are you ready? Here we go. Reverse. Last thing, you know Kelly Law 
says that we always do some sort of a plank. So, knees are on the floor, forearms are on the bench. Now, I'm going to come all the way up onto my toes, and I'm just going to hold it. Now, if that's not something you can do, just hold it right here. So come up, nice straight line. No bottoms up, okay? So after you come in, and just breathe right through it, and hold. You're doing it, keep it going. Suck that tummy in, but breathe. Don't want to hold your breath when you're doing abs. How about a countdown? Here we go. Eight, seven, four, three, two, and then bring your knees down. Just lay on your bench, on your side. Reach back and give me a quad stretch. We need to stretch the arms and the abs. Now figure why we are here, we might as well get the quads. Now you guys face the opposite way and get the other quad. Yes, you're looking at my back now. Isn't that perfect? And the bottom of my feet. Good job, Lisa. Come on to your back. Place your feet on the floor. Okay, and then bring it up. You're in a seated position. I'm just going to turn forward, but you guys can stay. It's more comfortable if you're, you know, facing away from the tall end. But if I do that, you can't see me. Bring one arm across. Good job, and then Lisa, other arm. Good job. Now just put your hands in a praying position and then press your elbows into your inner thighs. So you're opening up, getting a stretch in those inner thighs. Good job, and then release it. Interlace your arms behind your back. Squeeze your shoulder blades and lift. Good job, release it. And then just press back with your thumbs. Feel your biceps, a little bit in the shoulders. And arms over hips, cross both arms, getting both triceps at the same time. Ooh, good job, and then release it. Face your bench and come onto your bench on all fours. Now bring your belly button to the bench Head and glutes to the ceiling and look at the ceiling and feel your abdominal stretch. Good job, and release it. Now take your left toe and turn it under and press the heel toward the floor so it's on your calf muscles. Now if you can and you want, without having your bench pop up on you, you can come all the way up and press it back. Once you your calf muscles. Good job. And then release it and switch feet. You probably need your hands about mid-bench to keep the sand from popping up. Either just turn the toes under and press the heel toward the floor, or you can come all the way up. Now, stay right there. Bring the other foot up and come into a downward facing dog. Now, I want you to think about this if you can. You need to bend your knees slightly do. Bring your hands to the mat. Think about putting your head between your shoulders, getting a stretch in the shoulders. Now bend your knees, place your hands up high on your thighs. Now one vertebrae at a time, start to roll it up. But your head is absolutely the last thing to come up. And then give me a big inhale. In through your nose, oh, and out through your mouth. And guess what? You've done it. So hopefully you got cardio, abs, back, biceps, triceps, shoulders, chest. You know, you got it all. Cause you got some abs. We did those squats across. Um, plus you just got, you know, lots of legs anyway. But anyway, until I see you again, Hope you have a glorious day, and I miss you all. Oh, not, not liking it, <laughs> but this is better than nothing, so bye.